What's going on YouTube? GS right here. So in today's video I'm going to show you how to fix many of the Chimera jailbreak errors that you might have when you're jailbreaking with it or when you're updating with it and so on. It's a very simple fix that works with many many of the errors but this may not fix all of them so do keep that in mind. Now I've had success with this method before when Cilio didn't start or Cilio did not appear after jailbreaking or various things would not appear in settings for example the tweaks that I installed would not appear in settings even after installing the uh, preference loader and the other tweaks required for that and so on. Now you have to keep in mind that some people try to fix Chimera by just reinstalling it. You know, reinstalling it by just, you know, removing the application from the screen and installing it again from Ignition, Twigbox, App Valley, or using Cydia Impactor would not do because your file system already contains the files for the jailbreak. So what you're doing is to basically just install the application itself, but not the files that it comes with. So it's very important to do this if you want to try to fix something. Now, you should keep in mind that we're going to restore the file system to the factory settings. This doesn't mean that you're going to lose your data, you know, your photos or your contacts and so on, but you're going to lose your tweaks. So it's very important to keep that in mind because these will be removed. Now, what you have to do is to press in here on this button and to press restore rootfs. And I'm going to explain why this works. So press in here. And as you can see, it says that rootfs file system restore. Uh, and it's going to restore the file system next time we press jailbreak. We press OK in here, and as you can see now, instead of jailbreak, we have restore file system. Now, before we press in there, let me explain why this method works with some of the errors. Now, as I said, this is not going to fix every single possible error that can appear with the Chimera jailbreak, but I had success before with many of the errors that would persist even after trying to fix them and even after installing the required packages and so on. The reason is that Chimera actually creates files on the file system, you know, binaries and configuration files and so on. And so do all the components of the jailbreak, including, I don't know, dpkg, apt, and many others like tweaks and so on. And if one of these configuration files or binaries are wrong or not functional, they will create problems that will persist even if you go ahead and, for example, remove the Chimera from the screen and install it again. If you are already jailbroken once with Chimera, just because you drag it and drop it again in here from either Ignition, Tweakbox and so on, or with CDA Impactor, doesn't mean it's going to update those files that are already on the file system. So those will persist and if they are corrupted, they will keep on creating problems even with newer versions of the uh, Chimera. So the only solution in this case is to attempt to restore the file system. This will basically erase everything related to Chimera jailbreak but will leave alone any files that you have for your personal use, for example your photos or your contacts or your apps and so on, so that you can do a fresh re-jailbreak and basically fix some of the issues that can appear if files are corrupted. Now there are many ways files can become corrupted so I'm not going to get into this but one of the possible solutions is to try to restore the file system which I'm going to do right now. We're pressing here and I'm going to wait for it to complete. So I let the device reboot and then I jailbroke again with the uh, Chimera. It rebooted a few times and as you can see I'm now jailbroken. Now the problem I had with this device from where the uh, the video started is that Cilio would not start after being jailbroken. Cilio would just quit. So now if I open it, it does run. So that seems to have fixed the uh, the issue. It says in here an update is required, which I'm going to do later. But um, yeah, it seems to be working pretty fine. So as you can see, it's no longer crashing in my case. And it seems to have been fixed by uh, restoring the file system because that basically forces the Cilio to be reinstalled completely by the Chimera. When you update, it's normally not reinstalled. It stays there because it's already installed. So if there is a problem, it will persist from a version to another. Anyways, as I said, this method may not work for every single error, but if everything else you tried fails, then you can try this and you may be successful with it. Thanks for watching, I'm Geosnow and till the next time, peace out.